This video is to show the Sprouty working on SSB. I've got a coil plugged in for the 40 meter band. This coil covers, I think, about 6800 to 70, uh, 75, 60, 7600 kilohertz. So anyway, I don't have much time, so let's start tuning and uh, see what we've got. By the way, the RF gain, I don't know if you can see this, but I've got the RF gain wound really, really low, and you, you, you kind of need that for SSB. You don't, do not want to overload the detector. So. What you want with SSB is you want the audio gain up really high and then then you really ride the RF gain. You control your volume with the RF gain because you want to keep the RF gain as low as possible so as not to overload the detector. I was just touching up the fine tuning there with uh, the regeneration control works as a fine tuner as well as the actual fine tuning. Anyway, let's find something else. This is 40 meters on a Sunday morning, by the way, just before 10 o'clock in the morning. It was kind of late to put something like this together. And, uh, now, if you overload the detector, this is what happens. Listen. Uh, that guy had room, but uh, like he said, normally, minus degrees up there, but it was running between the 20s and the 30s, but, so it wasn't bad. Well, that's not too bad, yeah. Yeah, well, you know, and this is where I'm at. I'm down here in the south end of the sea. So Did you hear that? The detector starts overloading, and the oscillator actually starts pulling, and you do not, obviously, do not want that. So, so keep the RF game well down. Oh, that might might have been it. Hang on. Well, there you go. There's the Sprouty on 40 meters SSB. That sounds all right, doesn't it? 